Hello everyone, my name is Cammie and welcome to my channel, Key to Disney. If you're new to my channel, welcome. If you're returning, thank you so, so much for coming back on my channel. I do mainly Disney content with a sprinkle of Bath & Body Works. But in today's video, we have a different kind of video. I am going to be trying out some gel nail polishes from the brand Nail Reserve Los Angeles. They sent me an email and wanted to send some nail polish over for me to try. I'm not being paid by them to post this video or to review their nail polish. They just sent them over for me to review. So I'm going to be 100% honest i love nail polish and i love painting my nails but my nails are not painted right now because i'm going to be trying out their nail polishes so these are gel nail polishes that are vegan cruelty free they are a 21 free formula they are healthy and they are a long lasting formula and they really pride themselves on being like a vegan gel nail polish so they did send some over to me i'm sorry about the angle and this is my puzzle table so it has glue all over it so just ignore that but let's get into the unboxing but again thank you narrow reserve for sending these over to me i will have a link to their website down in the description below as well as a code that is key to Disney. I'll put it up on the screen so you guys can see it. And then that'll have you save 50% off your purchase of two, of a minimum of two nail polishes, but it doesn't work in combination with like other deals and sales that they have going on. So I'll link them down in the description below. But let's crack into this. So they did send me their nail reserve, their own brand, mini UV LED lamp. And it looks just like this. I have not even opened it up yet. I'm assuming I might Need to go grab batteries and i don't have batteries so um let me cut this open and i'll be right back okay i couldn't find my scissors so i just kind of ripped them open oh it comes with a cord okay so it looks like you need like um like a power block to plug their little charger in and then this is what like the little mini uv lamp looks like it's very tiny i feel like this would be perfect to use like on the go and it looks just like that and then it does come with the little charger so there is the UV lamp. So again, looks just like this and you can find that on their website to purchase. That was the first little box. Now this is the box full of nail polishes. Okay, so this is the box of nail polishes that I picked out. I believe I was able to pick out seven nail polishes and I tried to do like light colors, dark colors, and like shimmery ones like to mix it up to really test the quality of these nail polishes. Um, I don't think I'm going to do all of them today because I don't want to have like rainbow nails and none of these colors really go together, but I might like pick a sparkle and a light color to go through, but let me show you all of them. So this is what the bottle looks like. So I first got this little pink one and it is electric rose. And then on the side of it, it does have directions on how long you're supposed to cure them. So I got electric rose. The next one I picked out was this like more like brownie burgundy color and this is called dark and classy and that's what the top looks like the next one i picked out is ice mint and it's this like minty green color i absolutely love mint green the next one i picked out is not ashamed and it's this like gold sparkly kind of color and i thought that'd be fun to test how their shimmers and glitter polishes are I also picked out the Another Glass, which is this like a really beautiful Cinderella blue color. So I love that. And then they also recommend that you use their base, which is called the base, as well as their top coat, which is called the No Wipe Top. And they recommend these to get the best out of their gel polish formula. So these are the ones that I picked out and that they sent over to me. So thank you again to the Nail reserve so i'm gonna get a plug for my lamp and then we can start painting my nails i'm so excited to try these out okay so i had to change up my angle a little bit because the closest outlet is way over there and i couldn't reach but i at least got the lamp on the table and you just plug it into like a block like i'm using like an iphone like block so let's get into it i'm so excited to try these out i think i'm gonna do this um shade not ashamed on as like an accent nail and then i think i'm gonna use this cinderella blue called another glass super super pretty so we're gonna be testing out like a really light 
color as well as a super shimmery color. I might paint my nails on top of this box to give you guys a better angle because I don't actually, I don't know if you can see it, but I'll make sure I do close-ups. And I'm going to preface this by saying I'm not a nail polish expert. I'm not very good at painting my nails. So if I'm able to make a good nail look out of this, then I would highly recommend these. But you do have your base coat and your top coat. So this one says for the directions for the base, it says... This product must be cured with an LED light for 30 seconds per coat or a UV light system, two minutes per coat. And again, this is the base and that is a UV slash LED light. So I'm gonna meet it in the middle and do like about a minute of dry time. So I am going to start putting this on the base coat on and I'll be right back before we cure it. This is what the brush looks like. So like a pretty, pretty thick brush. Okay, so I have the thin base coat on. So I'm going to walk on over to my little LED lamp. Okay, so I put the timer in once and they're still wet. So I'm going to do it again. And I will say since the UV lamp is so little, um, I had to cure the thumbnail on its own, but I'm gonna try to cure them again and I'll let you know if after this cure, it's dry. Okay, I am back. This base coat is finally dry. I think UV lamp's not very strong, but I don't know if I would really recommend their brand of LED UV lamp. You could probably find one on Amazon that does the same thing, or if you have one already, you could probably use your own. But I'm going to paint my all my nails blue besides my ring finger here. And I'm going to paint that with like the shimmery not ashamed shade. But I'm going to start by doing a little coat of another glass. The directions on this, it says, again, 30 seconds a coat for LED lights or for UV light, two minutes a coat. So I'm going to start with this one. So let's see what the color looks like on the inside. Okay, that's really pretty. That's very pretty. Um, I will say the label, it's a little off from the color of the label. This is a little more of a lighter blue, but I am not mad at all. Um, I haven't used gel nail polish in a while, but I'm assuming that consistency is normal. So let's get started with painting my nails. <laughs> Okay, so this is the first coat of the blue. I will say it's a super, super thick formula. So the thinner, the better. I applied it a little heavy on these two nails and I did flood my cuticles a little bit, but it takes me a while to get used to like the formulation of the nail polish. And it is a very thick consistency, which I'm not used to by using just normal nail polish. This is a gel polish. So I'm assuming the consistency difference is normal, but this is my first coat and it's honestly a lot more opaque than I thought it was going to be. Um, you can definitely tell it needs a couple more coats, maybe one more coat, we'll see. Um, but for the blue, I'm so far impressed just based off of the first coat, but I'm definitely going to use a second coat. For my accent nail, I'm going to use this Not Ashamed color, which is like a gold glitter. And this is what this one looks like. Super, super pretty. But again, this is also a pretty, pretty chunky formula. So let's see how it applies. <laughs> Just off of first impressions, I'm so impressed with the sparkly shade. That was like a hundred times easier to put on and to work with over the base colors, like just the plain like creme kind of colors. This, super impressed with the sparkly shade. I'm going to put it under the lamp for about two minutes and let it dry. Okay, I let my first coat cure for just about two minutes. So now I'm going to paint this second coat and I'll be right back. <music> So this was after two coats. I am actually really impressed with this blue shade. If you wanted to get a little bit more out of it, you could probably do a third coat to make it a little bit um, more opaque. But I'm actually pretty happy with the way the blue is looking. And I think I'm going to quit it at two 
coats before I make a mess of my nails because I'm so bad at painting my nails. I will say this shimmery gold is perfection, literally so easy to apply. And the second coat definitely went on a lot easier than the first coat. And it's definitely better to put it on in thin coats than in thicker coats. But I'm going to let this cure under the lamp and I'll be right back to put on the top coat. Okay, so I thought I was filming, but I never hit record. I did just put on the um, top coat. It was super thin and super easy to apply. I will say it's a little bit more of a runny consistency compared to the other gel polishes in, from this company. So just be careful with that. But I am going to cure it under the lamp. Sorry, you couldn't see me putting the nail polish on while I was putting the little top coat on. I hope everything else recorded because I just looked over at my camera, wasn't recording when I was talking, but I am gonna cure this under the lamp and I'll be right back. I am back and this is what my nails look like. I think it turned out super, super pretty. My actual nail painting skills could be a little bit better, but I'm actually thoroughly impressed with these nail polishes. Again, these are from Nail Reserve. I'm gonna do my other hand off camera because that's gonna honestly take me a while and then I'll insert a picture on the screen like as I'm talking to show like what they look like with both hands done. But here it is. Again, I used the another glass like little cinderella blue shade as well as the not ashamed gold glitter i am going to swatch the other shades on this piece of paper really quick so you guys can see what they look like okay this is what they all look like swatched and cured i'm pleasantly impressed these look amazing so that pink shade is called electric rose then the green one is called ice mint and then next to that we have dark and classy which is more of like a burgundy color the blue one is on my nails and that one is called another glass and then last but not least we have not ashamed i of course did not swatch the um top and base coat because that would have done no good but you guys, I am so impressed by these gel nail polishes. These look awesome. Of course, on your nail, you might need a couple more coats because your nails aren't like completely white. But I'm so impressed. Again, here is what my nails ended up looking like with Not Ashamed and another glass. And then here they are in comparison to the swatches in case you're curious. That sparkle shade is absolutely unreal. I kind of wish I picked out more of those sparkles because they're so pretty. And this one actually has like a little bit of a kind of a iridescent kind of shift to it like a little iridescent kind of glitters but here is what the nails look like again i'm gonna do this hand off camera so we're not here forever but i will insert a picture at some point or i already did insert a picture of how both the nails look but again thank you so so much to nail reserve los angeles for sending these over to me again i do have a coupon code for 50 percent off it is key to disney but there's like certain capitalization so i'll throw that up on the screen now and as well as the link will be in the description to their website and to use the 50 percent off you have to order a minimum of two nail polishes and it can't be used in combination with any other sales they have going on but if you're unsure if it'll work or not it doesn't hurt to just put the code in but again thank you so much to nail reserve for sending these over to me i thoroughly enjoyed these i will rate the shimmer a nine out of ten and then this blue color like a seven and a half out of ten just because it was a little thick but i eventually got used to it and again these are soak off nail polishes and this is kind of just like my first impressions so i hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you guys did make sure you give this video a big thumbs up comment down below what color you would have painted your nails with and let me know if you have tried out nail reserve and if you're interested that link will be down in the description below and if you like seeing my face disney or bath and body works content make sure you consider hitting that subscribe button because it's free to you helps me out so so much and you guys can always change your mind later thanks again you guys for watching today's video and i'll see you in the next one bye